Hello everybody, it is Ryan here from Blackout Gamers UK bringing you the second uh, FA Cup prediction slash preview video this time of the Everton-Chelsea game. Uh, I shall be playing as Everton today as chosen by my girlfriend Christina. Thank God she didn't choose Chelsea. No one likes Chelsea. Uh, just as no one likes the free kick challenge That's mini game after rubbish. So at Goodison Park for the first leg and we're going to start off nice and brightly. Everton, a good attacking team, don't deserve to be where they are on the table. Um, not entirely sure how they're down there. Seamus Common, good attacking fullback, gets the ball in. Uh, but obviously, as with all crosses on FIFA, it goes straight to the keeper. Uh, that was meant to go to Morales, but he gets the ball in the end anyway. Cuts inside. Poor pass. Morales doesn't have a good game in this one, poor chap. Um, I, I do rate Morales as a player, but uh, he can be a bit reckless at times. Speaking of reckless, look at that shot from Fabregas. Yeah, we all know you're rubbish this season, Fabregas. Don't don't attempt things like that. They are not going to work for you. Um, so once again, on the attack, James McCarthy cutting inside. Now, I thought that was a stonewall penalty myself. Let me know if you think it was. He might have got a touch on the ball, but he took a fair old chunk of the man as well. Um, continue with the attack anyway. Play to the whistle and then, and then ballsing that up terribly. Uh, Dave Filet, you're absolutely tearing this right wing up with terrible passes like that, though. Don't really know why I went so much down the right wing in this game, um, but I seem to. Uh, through the middle this time for Lukaku. That is a wonderful tackle from Cahill, but you have to think that if that was you making the tackle, he'd have given away a free kick, possibly a penalty, and it would have looked a little bit more like this one from Jagielka, uh, which if you've seen my uh, previous video, Reading versus Palace, feel free to check that out. I make a similar tackle to that. I get away with it. I don't get booked in that one. Jagielka, not so lucky. Don't really know what he's complaining about there. Um, that was a poor challenge. Another poor challenge. Doesn't even get the pool or the player in that one. Jagielka chasing down William. Headed clear from John Stones. Poor touch from Barkley. And Matic decides to have a pop. Ala Fabregas two seconds ago. Slightly closer. But um, still off target, I am afraid. Matic. Um, and that brings to an end a very, very boring first half, I feel. Fair bit of attacking, but not, not a huge amount of highlights from that one. Going in at 0-0. Nil, nil. Um, so heading into the second half. Again, getting on the front foot nice and early. Um, poor touch from Morales, who, as I mentioned, can be slightly reckless, as with this challenge here. Take him out, boy. Scythe him down. He's not getting anywhere. Um, but Morales is getting in the book. Sorry about that, Kevin. My fault. As if you've watched some of my few videos, you may understand that I do enjoy a good old slide tackle. Um, and they are not usually particularly fair. Kind bounce for me here. Not there. That's, a, that's just a poor cross. Um, but we win the corner. Again, corners. Not very good at those in FIFA. Not my speciality. Um, this one managed to fall to Dave Leu, who shot is blocked. Lukaku cannot get his head on it. Um, but if you remember Phil Jagielka's screamer against uh, Liverpool last season, uh, this does not quite live up to that. But still, a fair effort for a centre-back, I feel. Good attempt, Phil. I'll give you that one. Um, more poor slide tackling at the start of that clip there um, and poor passing it's just generally poor play from me I, if you want to play me at FIFA then feel free you will probably probably batter me not if you shoot like that though Fabregas once again falling out of everybody's uh, fantasy football teams this season I'm afraid sir um, Dave Filo once again he's been a key key part of this game getting taken out there by Baba um, poor challenge for a, for a left back young, young chap I think um, however, Lukaku, you can jog on when we've got Leighton Baines in the team. England's England's free kick takers, I feel, are some of their main strengths. Baines, Barkley, Rooney. Um, and this is a good good distance. Good one for a left footer. As we show, as we pop that one home nice and easy. I think that's a wonderful free kick. And these replays really do not do it much justice. They're all from terrible angles. Um, apologies to my brother. He doesn't like Leighton Baines, but that had to be done, I think, Aaron. I'm sure you'll agree, and I'm sure he'll tell me how wonderful this free kick is if he watches this video. Courtois not getting to that one. This is a horrendous angle. I've no idea why they showed this one. You can't see anything there. Final angle, I think, shows me in all my glory, just curling that one gently past the post and taking a 1-0 lead in the second half. So all we got to do is keep it out on our boys. I'm not one for going defensive. I'm certainly not one for going ultra-defensive. I like to stay on the attack, as is shown with Morales here. Again, having another poor moment and just knocking that straight to Courtois. Not, not the greatest shot ever. 
And my amazing defending skills once again being shown as Coleman throws Aspilacueta to the floor. He's having none of your shit today, son. Um, and free kicks. I do like to be a goalkeeper on free kicks. I think it's a nice, nice new dimension to the game. Uh, not in this case, though, as I completely mess that up. I do apologise to Mr. Alan Shearer should he ever watch this video. Um, he doesn't like goalkeepers that step behind the wall and leave their side open. And I'll quite honestly, neither do I. Um, but in FIFA, you expect it. It's a video game. They always go for the same corner behind the wall. Uh, evidently not if you step too far to the right. And you completely mug yourself off. Now, this Niasi bloke, I don't know who he is. I put him in my 4 on 2 on 2 formation because he's better than Kone. I think he should be winning a penalty there. That's some good persistence to win the ball, get into the box, and then if that's not a penalty, surely it's a pass back because it means the defenders won the ball. Um, I don't know. Maybe I'm just being biased. Costa there going chest height in on uh, Howard. Not a fan of Costa. Um, Costa? Who's Costa? Costa. Costa Coffee. Um, and his uh, gladiatorial style of play. I think he's a bit of a bell end. Somehow Lennon gives away a free kick there. I thought that was a fair shoulder to shoulder run down the wing. Decide against being the goalkeeper on this one. Didn't go so well for me last time, but fortunately, Remy and Hazard completely mess up their routine there. Um, and we can break. Everton obviously quite good on the break. Dave Lay with his pace getting absolutely mugged off by Cahill. Uh, because, you know, FIFA. Um, and so that ends the first game. Um, going to a replay, having to take it to the bridge. Um, so not too keen on this. Uh, obviously Everton now in white, Chelsea in blue. And John Stones nearly giving away an early penalty there. I think he's got quite lucky with that one. That's just outside the box. Again, not going to be the keeper on this one. But fortunately, McCarthy makes a, a header away. And then William, uh, as Chelsea do, like to play backwards. Um... Chelsea dominating the start of this one as I dominated the start of the last one. Uh, some more weak defending from me. A poor header away, but fortunately we managed to track back and get that away from William before he can smash it past Howard. And a lovely attempted header there from Aaron Lennon. You utter mug. Um, however, he's now cutting inside. He's being tricky. He's doing a day for lay. Passes it off to Cleverly. And that's a good save, I feel, from Courtois. Good shot from Cleverly. Underrated player, in my opinion. Um, I always seem to like the... Man United midfielders that never get anywhere. Uh, but he's probably the best of the bad bunch. Um, good good tenacity here from Coleman to force the mistake. Morales getting the ball back to Barkley. Nice little one two with Tom Cleverley. Surely Barkley scoring from here. But it's good save from Courtois to deny the England man from close range. Thus ends the first half. Slightly more slightly better first half I feel than the uh, than the previous game. But still not a huge amount. And absolutely nothing in the way of goals. Um, so a couple of early corners. I like to go short sometimes for a corner. As in that case, uh, didn't work there. So if the short one doesn't work, put it on the penalty spot. And speaking of penalties, what's going on there? Lukaku's just been taken out by whoever on earth that was. I think it might be Matic. Surely that's got to be a penalty. The ball was nowhere near them. Um, but no, apparently this is a free kick instead. Even though... Morales, is that Morales again? Clearly wins the ball. I can't remember who that was. Didn't get booked though somehow. Clearly wins the ball. Um, but Chelsea have a free kick in a not particularly promising position. But they pass it through my poor defence. Howard makes a good save and then Oscar is quickest to react. Do put me 1-0 down. So, position I've not been in yet in this video. Behind to Chelsea. Got some work to do now. So we work the flanks again as we do. Nice little chip ball through there to Barkley. Whose turn and touch inside is not great. But the attacking fullback, Seamus Coleman, wins it back again. Plays it across the field. No, he doesn't. Uh, wrong clip. Whoops. Uh, plays it through to Lennon, who's surely got to be scoring there, but he hits it straight at Courtois, as Morales did in the last game. Not taking your opportunity there, Lennon. Don't look angrily at me, you bastard. Uh, lovely long shot from Barkley there. Easy save for, uh, for Courtois, but we want to see some more of that from Barkley for Everton and obviously for England at Euro 2016. Poor throw from Chelsea, but they still manage to somehow get the ball away from me. Uh, but they don't get away from Leighton Baines, who decides he's just going to march the guy down with no no uh, real need to. Um, so I don't normally show substitutions, um, but I have a bit of a think on this one. Um, you see me hesitate in a moment. I nearly put Funes Mori on. 
Um, but I decided against it. Neither Stones nor Jagielka are playing badly. I put on the uh, Everton Talisman, the cult hero, Leon Osman, instead. Um, this will become relevant in just a moment, for good or for bad. Decide now, and I will show you momentarily. Uh, I nearly go two behind after these substitutions, as Babar completely messes up that touch. Um, but Howard makes a good save. That might have been just going wide, I'm not sure. Um, but nonetheless, good play from the Everton keeper. Uh, again, if you see my Palace Reading video, you'll know that uh, I'm a fan of Wayne Hennessy, good goalkeeper, used to be at Yeovil, my team, um, back in the day. Um, Howard, also a good goalkeeper. But what's this, Leon Osman? Where does he come from? And he's potted at home past Paul... Uh, pear, pear, pear. Messing up my words there. Past Courtois is what I meant to say. Okay, lovely goal from Osman there. Sweaty goal, some of you might say yes. But I think in the 83rd minute of an FA Cup replay... You need to be taking any chance you've got. Lovely ball across and just calmly left foots it in. Leon Osman. So the momentum now in our favour. Another ball through for Deu Faleu. Deu Faleu. Deu Lufeu. Uh, started on the bench this game. Good ball to McCarthy who then decides to slam Cahill into the floor. Not having any of you Cahill. And Osman once again. Can he get an assist to go with his goal? Barkley's cutting inside. And surely that's a penalty as well. I mean the ball's gone. He takes the player who's chasing after the ball. Um, referee gives nothing. Don't know what he's thinking. And so we're heading into extra time. Possible penalties. I hope not because I've still got lots of English players on the field. And we all know how good England are at penalties. I.e. they are not. Um, so we're going to go for the classic. Obviously because we are doing an FA Cup game here. No goal and goal. I don't know. Do they do goal and goal anywhere anymore? I'm not sure they do. I remember they did silver goal for one tournament I think. In South America, possibly, where if you if you scored and you were leading at the end of the half, you managed to win extra time. It was very strange. I don't think it's caught on. Uh, just two highlights from the first half of extra time, both for Chelsea. I didn't have a very good half, that one. Uh, but Chelsea giving the ball away early in the second half of extra time. Ross Barkley with a lovely through ball to Lukaku. Surely must be beating Courtois. But no, Baba gets in the way, makes a good block, putting it away for a corner. Um, to Chelsea, apparently. No, just a different corner now. Um... Punch cleared by Howard. Dave Liu. Can we break with pace? Baba's in the way. Take it round him. Baba's getting tired. Dave Liu's got a bit more energy. Good ball through to Lukaku. He's holding off the defender well. Good strength on Lukaku. Back down to Dave Liu. Dodges one tackle. Dodges another. Passes it to Barkley. Who? Side foots it calmly into the corner of the net. Lovely goal from Barkley. Acres of space. No idea where the marking was there. Can you hear the Chelsea sing? I can't anymore. Being you at home, this is, I think, is a lovely angle of the goal. Great cut inside from Dave Lowe, lovely pass, and just calmly gets it around Courtois. Um, poor defending here from Coleman and, and myself. Baba, who seems to be everywhere in this game, is up front, um, but that's why he doesn't play up front, because his shooting is awful. Get back at left-back, Sam. Uh, no good from you there. Um, can Chelsea make it one final attack? One minute of added, uh, added time? One minute of added time, or maybe even added time. Cleared by Jagielka. But that's the whistle, and that is a win for me. Okay, excellent. So Everton through to the next round. Give us a like, a subscribe.